Good morning, everyone, and it is Thursday. A palace of gold, 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 A palace of gold, 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 A palace of guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel so first of all happy Thursday it is currently August 20th yes August 20th and it is 10 25 a.m. and I just woke up brushed my teeth washed my face and all of that and now I'm just gonna go wash my car real quick because my car is looking a little crusty right now because of all the dust storms here in Arizona and so for today I'm just gonna take you guys along we along with me on a day in my life and see how entertaining my life is which is really not that entertaining so I'm just gonna go ahead and wash my car real quick <laughs> So I decided to um, stop by and get some burritos from Filiberto's like I felt like I was gonna pass out here in line waiting to get my burrito all right so now that I finished eating I am gonna go ahead and start getting ready to continue my adventures for the day which I'm going to do be doing some fall Halloween decor shopping at Target and let's see where else the route takes what other route I go so let me just go ahead and start getting ready So this is the fit of the day. I just threw on my Shawn Mendes t-shirt and then just some plain black leggings. These are the ones I got from Walmart because I just wanted to be comfy today. And then for my shoes, I'm just wearing my black and white checkerboard vans and then just some red socks that don't even match my outfit. But then again, when am I ever matching? And then I just wore my little glasses chain today you know to spice up my glasses for today and well yep this is the fit of the day so now we're gonna head out to our adventures all right so we just got to our first destination which is Target I don't know if you can see. and we're just gonna check the Halloween decoration stuff here my sister's here with me but she doesn't want to be on camera but Capra and our mask you know different times so hopefully they have their little Halloween stuff out in the dollar section if not we'll probably check out another target so let's go ahead and inside and see what we got to location number two which is the Dollar Tree because we didn't find anything on the first target so we're heading to Dollar Tree see what we find here Dollar Tree 
Ooh, a lot of stuff. See, with all the trees on it, they already have their stuff. I'm trying to find some orange lights. They have socks here, so you know I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get these. These. I think I'm just gonna get one of each. These are cute too. This is what I got so far. I got some socks and then some lights. Alright guys, so I am back from my shopping. Sorry, I did not vlog much while I was out in the stores. It's because, you know, social anxiety. I still get anxious filming in public. But I did go to a couple places. I went to two Target and then like two Dollar Trees. So I'm just going to show you guys a quick little haul of the stuff I got. So my goal at to Target, like I told you guys earlier, was to find fall Halloween decor. But I did not find anything in the dollar section. But what did I expect? It's still August. But a lot of places already have their Halloween decor. Like the Dollar Tree. But sadly, my local Targets don't. But I did get a couple items from Target though. Alright. So the, so the first thing I got is I just got this um, foundation. The, since mine is running out. And it's just a Maybelline. Um fit me foundation because i don't really wear that much foundation only like right now when i film a video and then i did get these little harry potter slippers that were on clearance they were on sale for six dollars which is not bad for these bad boys and then i got just a clear backpack all right and then at the dollar tree i did do quite some damage i did get quite a few Stephanie, I'm trying to do a haul! Okay, I am back before I was rudely interrupted. Okay, so from the Dollar Tree, I got a couple uh, Halloween items because the Dollar Tree is on it. They already have all their Halloween stuff out. And I did not find um, Halloween socks at Target in the Dollar section, but I did find quite a few at the Dollar Tree. So I got this um, pair of socks right here. And then I got these cute little ghost ones. And then these little pumpkin ones. These are like super soft. So these are cute. And then I like these. These little green ghost ones. I love these because green again. Like always my favorite color. And then these um, candy corn ones. And then these. They had more styles but I just got these pair right here that were my favorite and then i just got this cute little headband i think it'll be cute you know like for pictures or whatever and it was a dollar so i was like why not so i got that all right and then i got quite a few um lights i just got some orange lights because i am planning to decorate my room soon for fall halloween i always try to decorate the first week of september like put on my fall and halloween decor which is why i'm getting stuff right now in august and i am just picking up on some items and then i do have a lot of little fairy lights around my room but for the fall i am gonna change my little lights to like cute orange lights to fit the little fall theme so i got quite a few um orange lights from um the dollar tree and then i got a couple of stuff so then i also got these bad boys right here i got quite a few but the only thing that sucks is that they're very glittery so the glitter falls out easily. I am thinking of putting these like, you know where my garlands are right there. The little green. Okay, and then oh, I just got some little bowls to mix my sauces when I make my Asian food. And then just a jarrito. And then more stuff from the Dollar Tree. I got a couple little pumpkins. I got these three right here. And what I'm planning to do with these is I'm thinking of adding them. So with these little pumpkins right here. I'm thinking of adding them on top right there where my plants are. Just Or if not, I'm going to add them right there under, under my TV. So yeah, that is my plan for these little pumpkins right here. I got quite a few, so I got these. 
and then I got these cool ones that are supposed to light up so I just need to put batteries and they all light up so that would be cute I think it'll look cute like putting some books and then on top of this so that's something I'm thinking about and then I just got this these little orange ornaments I am thinking of bringing out my white little Christmas tree that's about this big and putting like orange ornaments around it my idea for my room is to add a lot of orange because obviously when I think of fall and Halloween orange comes to mind so that's what I'm thinking of doing for my room so yeah that is my quick little haul of the items I got during my shopping today I am thinking of filming a so since I am going to be um, decorating my room soon for fall and Halloween, I am thinking of filming a video on it and doing like a fall room makeover. So if you are interested in seeing that, definitely give this video a thumbs up to let me know that you do want to see a fall hollow slash Halloween room makeover. Because I love doing room related videos, whether it's room tours, room decorating. I just love decorating my room so I can't wait to decorate my room. Alright guys, so I think I'm just going to call it a day now because I'm just going to be studying for the rest of the day. I'm sorry if this video was all over the place and I'm sure you're not going to be interested in just in me studying the rest of the day. But I am going to be studying for the HESI, which is the test you need to take to be able to enter to the nursing program. I am planning to um, apply for the nurse, going back to school to apply for nursing. I did graduate in May from com with a major in community health, but my goal is to be a midwife, so I am going to go back to school to be a nurse because I do have to be a registered nurse first before I can be, you know, a midwife, which is why I got to study. This is my first time taking the study, so I am a little nervous. So hopefully I do well. I did take the T's, which is another test to, for the nursing program because that's what ASU requires. So I did take the T's, T's exam. I did not do so well on the T's, which is why I'm taking the HESI. And I did hear the HESI is a lot more straightforward than the T's. But again, I, I mean, I haven't taken the HESI, so I can't really compare the two compare the two. So hopefully the HESI is a lot easier. I have my little notes right here that I used to study. So yeah, this is my little binder that has all my notes. Gladly for the program. The good thing for my program is that I don't have to study for science because they don't require science, only require math and English. So I have um, the section, this is the math section. I have just like a couple notes and just like little practice tests. So I got some notes and then just my notes that I've been taking. And then I have the vocab section. So I have all these vocab words I have to memorize. So I got these I got from like Quizlet. So I got a couple words here. And then I have like a grammar section. And then a reading section. So I have like all my notes. And like these little plastic things. So these are my notes. And then I also am using this book right here. Which is like the has the admission assessment book i've heard this book is very helpful so hopefully it is so i just got this book and then the notes on my binder all right so that is it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed seeing what a day in my life is like i know it's not very that inter interesting what i do but i hope you guys still enjoyed if you guys did like this video definitely give this video a thumbs up and also if you guys are new on this side of the internet or if you haven't already make sure to subscribe down below it would mean a lot to me if you guys do it and well like always see you guys next time